Hello, YouTube. Welcome to my wood shop. Today, I'm going to talk to you about an automatic vacuum system for your larger tools that require dust Daddy, collection. Did you take them? I'm doing it right now, babe. You want to help? So today, we're going to talk about this IVAC system. Works up to five peak horsepower. Very, very simple system to install. I'm gonna install it on this sliding 12 inch DeWalt table saw. <clears throat> so what I did is I already went ahead and installed it. So this is your power tool. So this is to my saw. This is to my vacuum. If you look down here, we also have an auxiliary line. Now, the way that this system works is you have two auxiliary lines. So you can have two separate power outlets for different applications. So you can have a 15 to 20 amp circuit for vacuum and a 15 to 20 amp circuit for your tool, which is exactly what I've done. So right here, this line is attached from here to here at the wall as my tool. And then this line right here, I've gone ahead and run down to an extension cord all the way on the ground, all the way to over to another 15 amp line system that I have designed, okay? And the way that this thing works is the minute that you turn the saw on, within about a second, within a few seconds, your shop back goes ahead and turns on. Once your shop back then goes ahead and turns on, it then goes ahead and starts to suck the chips. Now what I have is a cyclone system that I got from Home Depot for about 40 bucks. And I went ahead and set it up through there. So that top line there goes up into the shroud of my tool. You can see it right there. <clears throat> and then this line right here is the airflow that comes all the way down from the shop back. So this is how this entire system works. So if I go ahead and I take the tool and I turn it on, just listen for a moment and you'll hear the vacuum system start. And you'll notice that the system runs for about six seconds. Now, this is a great automatic system setup if you have the means. These are about $50. Okay, the shop back was about $50. The cyclone top in the bucket was about $40. And the saw was about $500. This is the 12 inch version that has the XPS light on it, so it's a little bit more money than the average one. Okay, so I'll have more videos to come. I'll go ahead and talk to you about the table saw or about the um, chop saw that I have and I'll let you know how well the dust collection system works on this but so far I've cut a couple pieces of this three-quarter inch piece of oak plywood and it seems to go pretty well you'll see that there's just a little bit of dust left over from when I actually did the cut and that's it I will have some more videos posted soon thank you very much